The latest VS Code release allows you to move the integrated terminal into the editor area. Let's take a look at this feature and some of the flexibility adds to your workbench layout. Now by default, of course, VS Code's integrated terminal is going to open down in the panel. So I have my integrated terminal down here. And if I want to go and move this terminal up into the editor area, all I have to do is click and drag on the little terminal identifier over here. I can drag it up into the panel. Now, if I had multiple terminals open, you would instead drag on the editor tab over here. But let's go back to the uh, previous version where I just had a single terminal. So I'm going to click and drag on this little terminal identifier. I'm going to go up until I have the drag indicator up here. And you can see that I now have a new tab that is opened up. So it's pretty much like a normal editor tab. Uh, and the terminal is now showing in the editor area. My previous file, so the code file here, webview.ts, that remains open. Now I can just switch over to this other file um, or the other editor tab here, which is my integrated terminal. And this integrated terminal remains interactive, so I can go and run commands. It is just a normal integrated terminal here in the editor area. Now what this lets you do is go and customize the layout in different ways. So let's say I wanted my integrated terminal to show to the side of the current uh, code file. So I can just click and drag on the file up here. I'll go drag over to the right hand side until I get at the partial dra uh, drop indicator here. And now I have my uh, web view file over here, so the code file, and then I have an integrated terminal showing to the side. I could also go and let's go split this current terminal by using control backslash or command backslash. So now I have another integrated terminal that is opened up. I'll just go and click and drag that until it's below my current co code editor over here. So now you can see that I have two integrated terminals, both open in the editor area. And as you can see, there's just a lot of flexibility in determining what your workbench actually looks like. Now a few other quick commands to note. If I want to go and actually move one of these terminals back to the panel, I can go open the command palette with Control Shift P or Command Shift P and say Move Terminal, and I want the Move Terminal to Panel command. This will go and move that terminal back down into the panel. Additionally, if I want to create an integrated terminal directly in the editor area, rather than dragging and dropping, I can use the Create Terminal. So I want Create Terminal in Editor Area, that command. That will go and create the terminal directly in the editor area. So that's a quick look at terminal editors in VS Code. Try experimenting to find what workbench layout works best for you.